Greetings comrades, Soviet Gaming here. In this video I will show you the best idea I ever had while I was playing this game. It will save you so much time and you can automate so many routine boring things in Ark Knights that will make the game for you even more enjoyable. You can focus on important stuff now. To make all those tips work you gotta go to the description or in the command section and download Bluestacks by the link that's over there. Bluestacks is an app emulator, this is Android emulator, it's safe. Everybody is using it, your favorite YouTubers are using it, I'm using it for about two years already and you will love it. So first a quick tutorial how to get the Bluestacks, it won't take long. You go to the link that is in the description, you go to the Bluestacks website, here you click download Air Knights for PC, the download has started, it's downloading, you will get the installer down there, over here, you click on the installer, you press run, it will install a Bluestacks for you guys. You press yes, after that you will do the install, I have it already, so you will have to install it, it's kinda simple, you just follow the instructions. After that you log in on your Google account and you're ready to go. And if you already have Bluestacks, you gotta click open now over here and open in Bluestacks, it will lead you straight to the application in the App Store, I already have it installed, so it got me to the application. And when you download it, you will see it right, where is it, uh, right here. You go to Ark Knights and then you do your stuff. So for example, you want to farm these Oriro cubes, right, in 1.7. You want this, you already clicked auto deploy, then you record a new macro, you press start, then you press, uh, wait a little bit because it might load, so wait for like 5-10 seconds so it will work properly, mission start, there we go, and then you're just waiting through the stage, yeah, it will load and everything, so um, it will take you like an hour of sitting here in order to do it like what? 10? I don't know, uh, 20 times? I don't know, I don't know about that. It will take a while and you can save the time by just making it on auto and uh, letting it play automatically. I will just uh, fast forward to the ending. The last enemies are coming. Alright, mission accomplished. There we go, so you don't have to wait for eternity and... Uh, yeah, you just wait till everything will be over. You click here once, you click here twice, in order to get rid of everything basically. You click here a little bit more times, just in case if some of those notifications will pop up, right? So you got back to this area, and then what you do is you stop the macro. There we go. Now you have this new macro over here, you can rename it to um, uh, auto, st auto Stage for example. Oh, this is Russian, I'm sorry. Auto Stage Arc Knights. After this, you just click on this cog over here and uh, you either select uh, infinitely until stopped if you want to farm it non-stop. If you want to farm it for a specific duration, you click for a duration of, for example, I don't know, one hour. If you want to farm it for one hour, you click here, you click save, you close it, you play it and there we go. Uh, magic is happening, guys. It's being done automatically. Automatically. So you can go AFK for an hour and come back and get your goddamn resources without sitting here and clicking that stuff. Too bad, too bad the developers didn't introduce times 4 speed for this game because it needed so much because this grinding is killing me. That's why actually playing it less than I would. I, I actually love the game, but that fact that you have to grind that much is a little bit annoying. But this trick that I realized just now, I don't know why it took me so long, uh, I was using it for AFK in you know, for other games that I play, so uh, yeah, I realized it just now and it will save you so much time on it. You see, everything is happening automatically and in the end, let's try to click it till the end again. Oh, blyad. There we go. So we're back to the end of the fight. Let's see, we are getting the rewards. Alright, that's good, that's good. So this is good for any stage grinding, be it campaign stage, be it event stage or any other stage. And yeah, we're back to the menu and I think right now it will go on the loop, it should. If the mission will start again now, that means everything is working just nicely. There we go. So it's looped and it will work like that for as long as you want. This is a lifesaver for this game, guys. I have no idea. Now I'll play it way more. And this is not it. There are other ways to use blue stacks to play this game effectively. And then you can create a macro for your daily activity. So. For example, uh, you want to do daily stuff, which you always do, you go to the base, uh, alright, it's loading, you already started the macro, so it will record all your actions, and here, you are going to the notifications, 
collecting everything, boom, collecting trust, boom, uh, orders acquired, going here, mm -hmm. precious metal orders, click, click, click. So it will save you time every damn day, so you won't have to do it manually, you will have to record a macro once and record all your routine daily operations and then you won't have to do them ever again just you know you start the game you press the macro and then you go whatever i don't know wash your uh, brush your teeth or something like that it's better not to touch those because those are you know the ones that you have to do manually but yeah you can find the use for the macro in this concern as well yeah but still the main thing will be the grinding because it's, it takes so much time to manually grind the repetitive stages, guys. So much time. Unluckily, everything else you can do by clicking different base mechanics and stuff requires you to properly aim. I haven't found a way to automate it. If you have any, your own ideas, let me know the commands. That will help us so much. Help the community by uh, making a command. And uh, yeah. And thank you for watching. I hope you liked the video. I hope that tip was useful for you. All the links for the Bluestacks download will be in the description of the video and in the pinned comment. Also, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. Make sure that bell notifications are turned to all. This is really important. And join our Discord for our fantastic friendly community. Follow me on Twitch for live streams. I'm streaming mobile and PC games over there. It's really fun. Join me on social media like Instagram, Twitter and Facebook. There are groups and shit, so you will like it. And yeah, that's about it for now. I hope you liked the video, guys. I hope it was useful. Thank you for watching till the end. Soviet out. See ya, comrades. Bye.